everybody welcome to day 21 apparently this year Yule is tomorrow or the winter solstice is tomorrow but that plays with my mind because I I always in my head I've always thought the 21st of December is the winter solstice and the 21st of July is the summer solstice so yeah Ivy keeps saying it's not till tomorrow mum but I'm like no in my head it's today so happy you all if you celebrate uh, either today or tomorrow <coughs> I was going to film walking into Lidl which is where I'm parked at the moment but um, Storm Pier is blowing such a hoolie out there that I'm going to need all my hands and effort to just keep me and my shopping bags and my trolley on a, <laughs> on a on a straight course into the shop so uh, I made a very bad judgment clothing judgment a big mal wardrobe malfunctions this morning it was not the right day to put tights and a dress on it wasn't a choice though because I got no um, clean dry leggings they were all still wet so it was that or, or come out with bare legs <laughs> So tights and a dress it was. Anyway, <coughs> excuse me, I'm feeling much better, but I think my sinuses are starting to drain now and that's what's causing that cough. It's like post-nasal drip. <coughs> excuse me. I keep procrastinating. I've been sat in the car for about 10 minutes on the phone to my mum, but I'm not going to get the food in if I don't go and do it. So I'm going to suck it up. I'm going to get my pound out for the trolley. I really need to get a trolley token. I was saying to my friend this morning, I don't know why Lidl don't sell trolley tokens. Or if they do, I've certainly never managed to find one. Right, I'm going, I'm doing it. I'm not messing about anymore. Hello everyone. I'm back from Lidl. Uh, I got more there than I expected to. I didn't think I'd be getting a celeriac or sour cream for instance, but I did, I got both of those things. So that was very good indeed. Less to get at Sainsbury's tomorrow. Right, it's time to open these here advents. Day 21. Oh. Ah, an orange and a peach. I love them both. I should definitely make sure they go next to each other because that'll look fab. And a green shiny. And, ooh, Noisette Triangle. Don't they just call this green triangle now, or the green one? Apparently, Noisette is too difficult for us to say. That gets on my nerves. Like when they changed Apple Ties to Apple Tizer, because I've already called it Apple Tizer, when that wasn't its name. <laughs> Oh dear, I'm a bit of a language pedant. Never mind, should get off my high horse. Ooh, this one feels quite weighty today. Let's see what's in Davina's parcel. Oh, Ooh. oh, look, a candy cane. Candy cane, I love a candy cane. If you've been watching Ali from Little Drops of Wonderful, I'm, um, I'm totally in love with her candy cane necklace um, and I'm, I keep like thinking oh I really want to get one but it's like one of those things where you like it because someone else has got it and then when you get it for yourself it doesn't feel as nice as the one they've got even if it was exactly the same one do you know what I mean is that just me <laughs> let's have a look at this gorgeous fat oh look oh it's too cute oh can you see Fairy 
like some birds, bunnies, hedgehogs, deer, toadstool. Oh, that's so cute. Pixie Noel 2 by Tasha Noel. Oh, that's quite a big piece. Thank you, Davina. I love it. And Day 21 has got music on it. Let's have a look what's inside here. Oh, 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 many lovely things. Ooh. Oh. I've got some neon yellow yarn, which I love. I've got a candy cane, which I love. And this is so funny. I've got two Chapel View Crafts charms. Now, one of them is a mug with coffee or tea. I'm not sure which. Can you see it? Really sweet. And this one is shortbread from Scotland, of course. And this is so funny because I <laughs> I sent Rachel a Chapel View Crafts charm as well. And that was like a little globe and it had tiny little candy canes and snowflakes and things in it. <laughs> Great minds think alike. Thank you, Rachel. They're so sweet. I shall really look forward to using those in projects next year. Really lovely. <laughs> right, now the slightly less pleasant job of putting the food shop in the way. I've got to clear the sides first. <sighs> Why can't it all be fun and crochet and knitting, eh? Ali was saying that in yesterday's vlog. She went out and spent all day running around in circles doing lots of irritating errands and things. All she really wanted to do was sit on the settee, crochet and look at her fairy lights. Yeah, same Ali. <laughs> Well, hopefully we'll be able to do lots of that over the next, over the coming days. Okay, onward, ever onward. I'm just catching a quiet half an hour before I've got to go back out. It's a busy night tonight because Ivy's got her school Christmas performance um, and she sings in the choir, choirs. She sings in the junior choir and the senior choir, um, even though she's not considered senior yet, but I think... Um, she looks senior and she, she's a very good singer as well so i think that's probably why um but yeah i've just uh, been running around doing pharmacy jobs and other such and shopping and things like that all day <clears throat> um and i've got to go back out to the pharmacy because basically they've sent me on a blooming wild goose chase. So I've got half of the prescription, but the other half hasn't been sorted. So I've got to go back and try and get that. But I can't, I couldn't go straight away because um, the original pharmacy, the one I usually use, closes for lunch for an hour and a half. So I'm going to combine it with picking Ivy up from school. <clears throat> I'm trying to ease her through the last couple of days of school because she's so exhausted. It's been an eight week long term here in Derbyshire and she's also had some assessments at school which have really taken it out of her. So I'm trying to be kind to her for her, for the last couple of days and sort of help her. She's only got until about midday tomorrow. They break up at lunchtime at senior school. So I'm having a coffee and I'm knitting away on my sock. <clears throat> And I've just put the heel line in, so I feel like I'm on the home straight now because I'm down the foot of the second sock. I'm having a nice coffee. It's a, a company called Littles and it's um, they do flavoured coffees, but they're not sweet flavoured or anything like that. They're very nice. That's rich hazelnut, I think, the flavour. And I finally fetched out my yarn that I'm going to start my Christmas Eve socks in. So this is the yarn that Paula bought me for Christmas last year. And it's Snuggly Stars yarn coming home for Christmas. And the colours in it are so pretty. And I think I'm going to knit the Find the Joy socks by Kay Linton from the Crazy Sock Lady. I'll pop a picture in here so that you can see what they look like. Uh, <clears throat> And, uh, and then I want to try and choose a contrast colour because I think I want to start the sock off with a 
contrast and then I want something for the heel and the toe. And then I need to sort a project bag, get this wound up, progress keeper, all that kind of thing. So I might get a chance to do that later, but if not, I'll probably do it tomorrow. But isn't it beautiful? Oh, I love the speckles. And the colours. Oh, I love that so much. Can't wait to see how it knits up. It's always exciting, isn't it? I like getting this. So there'll be a there'll be a skein under the tree for Christmas Day. <clears throat> and that will get put away until next 24th of December. And then I'll cast that on. And I get to look forward to it for 364 days. <laughs> it's brilliant. I love it so much. And sometimes I get it out and look at it and squish it and think, ah, can't wait. Oh, I've got my other yarn caught up with it. I'm probably not going to quite get this pair finished, <clears throat> but I'll get it to a point where it won't take much finishing off. So I'll be able to do that probably over the Christmas break. And then I'll knit these through into January, probably. I usually end up finishing them in January. There's my blanket. I've got another couple of pretty yarns, uh, fabrics to put in there. Not my blanket, my quilt top. But I'll probably not get a chance to do that for the next couple of days now. Right, I'm going to carry on watching Gainer and I'm going to finish my coffee while it's warm. Hmm. Hello, everybody. I'm just dropping in to very quickly say goodnight. I've been at Ivy's school christmas concert to watch her sing in the choir which well, is in two choirs actually so i had a lovely evening listening to her perform and uh, i've just got back hopped in the shower quickly but i <laughs> can't quite believe it i've literally got one stripe left to do and i'm on the toe so i might actually get these completed before christmas eve which is quite i can't believe i've knitted the whole of the foot I knitted quite a bit this afternoon and then I reckon I knitted from about here up to there in during the performance. <laughs> so I'm going to see if I can get just start the toe. And I mean, I'm not expecting to finish it tonight because it's getting quite late and I'm very tired. But um, I'm just going to watch a little bit of Vlogmas and I will see you bright and early tomorrow morning for our annual trip to Sainsbury's. I don't just go the once a year, but I mean my annual Christmas trip to Sainsbury's. <laughs> Okie dokie. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.